Hi everyone, it's Karen here with a ATC tutorial making dream catchers. Enjoy! I used three ATC sized cars from Prima and I applied some 3D matte gel on one of the sides and then I glued a baby wipe that was already dried. I had used this baby wipe for wiping my table from inks and paints and it just gave it a really nice color so I thought I could use it for something once it was dry and that's what I did. I used it for my background because it looks like a 1960s tie-dye kind of um, background which I really liked for the dream catchers. I cut around the cards and then just glued some of the edges to make sure that everything was glued properly. I cut out some doilies out of an old doily mat and then sprayed them with three different color bloom sprays. I used gilded, empress gold and gold foil. My cards were a little bit too long so I just cut them to the appropriate ATC card and then placed the doily and glued it onto the background. I really like reusing these baby wipes because it's a good way to recycle things and it just looks like so nice because it can catch colors from your table and clean everything. I use some brown archival ink to stamp a little bit of a script like um, background and then I added some feathers. I glue them onto the bottom of the, of the card just randomly so they're but at different heights so they would look like real dream catchers. While the gel medium was drying from the feathers, I used some turquoise stickles and created some nice uh, doodling and highlights to the, uh, to the dream catcher. I just added dots around the circle and in the middle just to make it a little bit more realistic. Then using a brown Molotow acrylic marker, I just drew the lines to make it look like strings between the dream catcher and the feathers. And then just uh, um, doodled some border, a border around the card, just with my, just lines around the card to kind of frame it. I used the stickles again to create some glittery bubbles right between in the connection between the string and the feather to make it more realistic. I glued a word sticker on each one of the cards and sealed it with matte gel medium and then used the brown Molotow pin again to just frame the word. This was a really quick card to make it took me all in all about 45 minutes for all three cards and it's also a good way to recycle some old baby wipes or doily mantle pieces that you don't want anymore from your grandma or just anything at all. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked my video I would love for you to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Bye!